hello viewers welcome back to my channel again today and today let us learn about angles measurement of angles of right angle obtuse angle and acute angle before starting this video don't forget to like share and subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon so that you get notified whenever i come up with a new video so let's get started some angles given in the chapter and let us learn about how to measure these angles and place the value here okay so let us take an exercise book so for measurement all we need is a scale a compass a protector and of course a pencil so this this scale is called a protector you have in your geometry box see here so let us take a line here let us make a line with no measurement let us make a line here okay then take a point here any point on the line then see this point here on the protector this point so you have to match this point with this point now see it here this point has matched with this line you can see here this point and this line has to be equal now take straight from this and here you find 90 there you place a point here see now with the help of a scale you make a line here have you seen it so this is called where you have taken the point 90 so this angle is called 90 degree okay so this angle is called 90 degree so you are clear now how to measurement an angle of 90 degree and this angle is also called right angle okay so this angle is called right angle right angle in this way you will be able to find right angle where the angle is 90 degree so now let us find another angle so first let us learn how to measure an acute angle and an obtuse angle so what is an acute angle see here in this protector this angle is called 90 degree or right angle triangle and the angle smaller than these which are less than 90 see 80 70 60 50 40 30 20 10 and 0 this all angles less than 90 degree are called acute angle okay it is very easy to measure an acute angle in the same way we have measured the right angle so let's get started again to measure the acute angle so let's make a line again now take any angle less than 90 it can be it can be 80 70 60 you don't take the number upwards okay take the below numbers so now let us make this 60 degree angle again you take one point here place the protector in this point the point of this protector in this point you can see clearly maybe yes see these two lines has also need to match with this line have you seen it yes now if you want to measure an acute angle it can be any angle less than 90 degree so let us take 60 degree straight here so this point the longer line see this one is called 60 degree angle and let's make a line we can make line with this protector also any scale so this angle is called a 60 degree angle okay in this way you can measure any angle less than 90 degree and that angle is called acute angle okay it is very clear to you now let's now measure obtuse angle and obtuse angle is an angle more than 90 degrees see here more than 90 degree 100 110 120 30 40 50 60 70 80 all this angle greater than 90 degree are called obtuse angle so if you measure an angle more than 90 degree we call this angle as obtuse angle so let us again measure in the same way an obtuse angle so let us measure 
let us draw an obtuse angle in the same way we have drawn the two other angles see let us draw a line here in the same manner take a point here and now let, with the help of a protector see your obtuse angle can be any angle greater than 90 degree we can take any angle let's take this 110 place the point on the protector on the line see here these two lines is also matched with this line and the point middle point is here now let's make an angle 110 see here this point now let us make a line okay with the help of a scale we can we have made a line here you can rub this line now this angle 110 degree this angle more than 90 degree is called the obtuse angle so we write here obtuse angle so you have learned now how to measure right angle acute angle and obtuse angle so we come back to the page on the book and now we will measure all the angles given in the book and place the value okay let us now measure this angle take the protector place this point of the protector here see this line here it's in 60 degree so we take this line 60 degree straight first we need to match the line also yes see it is in 60 degree so this angle will be 60 so we write here 60 measure 60 degree now let's measure this angle take the protector place in the same manner like we did in the previous one place this point here now we match this line and see it is 90 degree so we write here 90 degree and in the measurement also we write here 90 degree now let's measure the other angles also see this angle it seems like an obtuse angle which may be greater than 90 degree c we can here see clearly that it is 120 degree so we write here 120 degree 120 degree the next angle in the same way we will measure the other angles see here yes this angle is 130 degree so we write here 130 degree and in the measure also 130 degree in this way we will measure all the other angles and show you